And hello, folks. And that's for Matt Holbrook. Okay, he has 333 subs, six shorts, and 98 videos. Please check him out. <coughs> okay, I get a lot of things from Hobby Lobby, and Matt brought this up. Let me see if I can do it. Yeah, there we go. You can make a spice kit out of it. You can get either plastic or glass. I'm old school. I like glass. And it'll hold three vials of spices. Now, I have this one, regular table, oops, table salt or curry or cinnamon. Or you could do, you get the coin bags from Hobby Lobby. And you can put in whatever spices. And I'll fit a dozen more of these little pouches, dime bags, of your spice. About five of them. Another thing I like to do is gadgeteering. Now, if you watch my old video, we were doing basically a metal matchbox with a striker on it. Like I said, Uncle Alan likes to do gadgets and stuff. Let me put this away for a second. I also recycle. You could do snuff tins. Now, Matt brings up a good point. They do leak, so I wrap a little bit of electrical tape on it to seal it. Here, let's see if I get this popped open. There we go. And then you have your matches. And also comes with a strike on the pad. You can pick up the either little linen pouches, sachet pouches, uh, pouches. Before you use it, boil it first. All right. This is a linen bag. You can pick up the dime bags or stamp bags at Hobby Lobby. And you get these little vials. Okay, not rocket science, folks. Like I said, do something creative, like CR. He does a lot of recycling. <coughs> That's creative redundancy. Okay, not a problem. Recycle, gadgeteer, do whatever you like. Now, Perverness Veteran brought up a good point about cigarettes. Uh, usually, when I use these or give them out, I'll have duct tape around it, and I'll have probably a survival kit on it, or I'll have some kind of strip on the back for lighting matches. Okay, fairly easy, something to do. Gadgeteering 2.0, folks. Okay, me, I, I got a whole bunch of things I plan to do with that. Might give it away. Like I said, folks, check out your local hobby store. See what you can do. See what fun stuff. People are still trying to figure out what kind of horrible weapon I can make out of this. It's a bead. Bead end. They still don't get it. Remember what I taught you with the paracord loop? So people don't understand. It's just a simple knot. Like so. And when you pull on it, it breaks apart. And a lot of people, a little strangling with it. Try it. And then they find out, I got paracord and Uncle Alan's beating the crap out of me. Okay, another thing. Uh, let's see. This is a backup knife. It is not a knife. If a guy has a bowie knife, you run away. This is used for close combat. And if they see the knife... You lost after battle. This is like a backup knife. I keep telling this to people. They, 
Uh, what happens if the guy has a machete or a boy knife? I probably shoot him in the head with a 357. Okay, a backup knife. It's like Lord. It's like good grief. Even Batman knows how to do that. Uh, let's see. Make sure to check out David Lynn, Purple Principal. Okay. Let's see what we got. Check out Prepping by Faith, Prepping with Sarge, Alpine Preparedness, Sassy Gal Prepping, Nene's Prepping Kitchen Now Northern Prepper. If you're complaining about the smoke, folks, go look at JD. It's a control burn, mismanagement. Okay, Biggs Prep. Go check out her old video supporter. God called her. She ain't dead. She's working for God. Uh, Garden State Gardener, Joe's channel. Ch check it out. Help out Garden State Gardener and Joey. Who's your prepping nurse? That's Sally's channel. Check her out. Later I'm going to add Danger Dale to it. Don't forget, folks, say no to Captain Crazy and crew. Join up Die Bullfrog 79. Hit the like button. Leave a nice comment. Send money. $2.17. See PayPal below. Stop the madness. Keep calm. Don't panic. Carry on. Save America from 2040. The horrors. 17 years left, folks. And I'll catch you later. You have a nice day. This is your old pal, Uncle Al. Remember, all this is an illusion. Get to know people. Go camping. Go RVing. Vacation out of America. Get away from the 50-mile death trap. Okay? Because a lot of people don't understand that. Long live the Republic. Be a nice person. Grow a garden. And I'll catch you there. God bless. Bye now.